I also think that verbal abuse is just the same. Justice because work. Yeah. Sometimes I'd rather you yep. hit me because yes. I can heal from that. That yes. mental. Yes. Because yep. the yes. verbal abuse that was put, put, pushed upon me was the way I had to fight. Oh. What's your worst breakup story? Um, there was this one relationship where I felt like he was trying to hold over me and make me mm. fearful. Mm -mm. And so I felt threatened. And I was like, am I really going to have to fight for my life right now? So, and I had no money. I was living in this little raggedy ass apartment with my son. And he saw me look, I had this Nefertiti bust that I found at the African market and it was sitting on like this little column. So he saw me look at it while he kept raising his voice. And I looked and I guess it was the way I looked at it. He said, you know what, I'm gonna leave. So he was ready for war, but I don't know, whatever the strength that came up in me, the dude knew, ah, yeah, I better leave. <laughs> So I never felt threatened in my life before, but that day I did. Mm. I said an abusive relationship. I feel like a lot of times it's hard to walk away because mm -hmm. you just be feeling like, okay, the first time it won't happen again, the second time it won't happen again, and then it become an ongoing thing. And you feel like I love this person and they doing it because they love me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I feel like an abusive relationship. Yep. It's, it's very hard to walk away. You gotta be strong. You gotta tell yourself like, for real, this is the last time because it's going to get worse and only get worse. I also think that verbal abuse is just the same. Just as work. Yeah. Sometimes I'd rather you yeah. hit me because yes. I can heal from that, that yes. mental. Yes. Yeah, because the yes. verbal abuse that was put, put, pushed upon me was the way I had to fight. Mm. So I had to fight with a verbal statement. Mm -hmm. right. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So when I, and I hate to sound like cliche or like I'm saying this because, this is why I fought with Good Morning Gorgeous. Mm. Good morning, Mary. Good morning, I love you. Because everything that this man said to me yes. was contrary to mm -hmm. that. Mm -hmm. You ain't shit, you ain't this, you can't do this, you ugly, you ain't this person's pretty, this person's pretty. So I'm like, oh shit, okay, okay. my ex-wife is this. So I had to fight in my prayer time mm. in the morning mm. with that same kind of fight with that same kind of um, tactic. Mm -hmm. So the tactic was verbal. Mm -hmm. So I had to fight it verbal and I had yes. to fight it with, good morning, Mary. Good morning, gorgeous. Good morning, I love you. Even when I mean every other woman was prettier than me, better than me, right. smarter than me, finer than me, thicker than me. I had to fight that with those words right mm -hmm. there. Good morning, gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Because gorgeous, I never thought I was. Mm -hmm. And I beat him, I beat. It wasn't about a physical thing, it was mm -hmm. about speaking to me, yeah, me, mm -hmm. me, me, me. And I won and I'm winning. Yes. By any means necessary, ain't yes. nobody gonna be able to me. 